Hello, and today I'll be showing you how to really break your computer on scratch. You'll not really be breaking your computer, but you'll do something to scratch this code that it will glitch itself, and you won't be able to click any blocks or move any blocks, but you can still exit by closing the tab. I like to use this for like many pranks on my project, like April Fools. So this is one of my funniest things to do. So first, I'm going to delete the sprite and create a new sprite and call it kill code. This is the easiest way how to make your computer crash. Um, there's many different ways to, but this is the most simplest and easiest. Now, when the green flag is clicked, I'm going to go to the blocks and name it kill code. And then you're gonna hit done. And then when the green flag is clicked, we got a kill code. Now for the kill code, you're gonna forever create clones of yourself. This won't do anything right now. It'll probably slow it down a few FPS frames per second, but it won't do much because after 40, 60 costumes, Scratch is like, nope, no more cost clones for you, and it shuts down the clone limit. So you can't really crash your computer with this code. But when I start as clone, I'm going to create a clone of myself, then you're going to delete it. What you're basically doing is, when you're creating a clone, one clone, you're cloning your, another clone, but you're deleting this the first clone, and the cycle of Pete's and Scratch is like, what in the world is happening? And it crashes. So now, if you... Let me save. And if I press the green flag, hopefully this will work. Press go. And it instantly breaks. I'm actually trying to click. I'll put my mouse close so you can hear. I'm trying to drag the block so I can't press stop and I can't do anything. Oh, I don't know if you can see it, but it says page unresponsive. So yeah, I guess that's how you crash your computer on Scratch.